enough of that. Um, today, I'm going to start today with clearing my eye and uh, a mail call. First one, not showing you who it's from, oh. but I'm going to tell you. It was from my buddy, your buddy, and everybody's buddy, Gonzo Gary. Now listen, this is a, a special announcement. He sent me another stack of cat stickers. So if you want to send him a sticker from your channel, um, I will send you a sticker, a cat sticker from him. Um, and uh, you just got to PM me, and I'll give you his address. And uh, that's how that works. So he sent, this is the last of them, he said. It's a nice little stack. He says, uh, this is the last of them. Thank you, everybody. So just so you guys all see that. He, he's thanking everybody for uh, sending him the stickers. He, you know, uh, he enjoys hanging them up and uh, receiving them um, as well, I think. So, and it's another mail day. I finally got the package with the sprocket. I'll show it to you. It was a used, not a used sprocket, but a rusty sprocket that I got on a discount. But what they did was it, it looks like they put oil on it to protect it. So I'm probably going to take it downstairs and clean it up because the other side they did too. They, this is like an oil to protect the rust spot. So I'm probably going to clean this up and paint it so it's really nice. And uh, that's what I'll be working on somewhat today to finish up this go-kart so I can get on to other things, you know. So uh, once again... Gonzo Gary, he's looking for stickers from everybody's channels. And you dizzy? I'm looking for uh, that sprocket to work out mint. So let's go downstairs. Well, you dizzy was here playing with the go kart, and this just fell into my lap. Ron wants to punch me. Bad. I beat his ass. He's mad because the circle is actually round. This guy walked by, listen, this guy walked by, spotted the go-kart, talked to Dizzy for a minute, gave the guy's girl a sticker. He said, I'll be back, and comes back with this thing. So, the next project is probably going to be a little a little mini bike, like little doggies. Friggin' right. So, that's cool. Stop crying, Ron. I know I showed you guys this, but I didn't really tell you much about it. That is actually going to go on top of this. And uh, I extended the gas line. Um, I was going to poke it through the hole right here. But I'm actually going to cut this out just so it don't rub against it. But I cut that uh, angle out. And, and it's got bolt holes right there to mount on the top of the motor. These are the mount the tank, so I had to move the tank over that much. And uh, that actually comes even with the outside of this. And I'm going to paint that black too to match. And then the tank will pop right on that. And I won't have to drill no hole, new holes in that because I don't want to compromise that uh, the plate any more than it is. You know, the, the plate's a standard plate, and it's got the slots, and I'm not going to mess with it. Because that's what, you know, good guys do. So I know we're doing a lot on this cart, but, you know, building cool things takes a little while. And uh, at least new projects are rolling in. So I'm going to get to this. I'm going to get to cutting this up a little bit more. Uh, just a little groove in there. And uh, then I will clean that all up and paint it up, find some bolts for it and whatnot. So we got another project for the U-Dizzy shop. I'm not really sure what it is, but it has uh, the brake pad there on uh, the flips. I don't know if you can see it on the right there. But that works. Both the uh, pegs are on it and, and work. Um, 
I don't think that's the tire for it. Definitely not. But I'm going to have to look for the a tire for the back. Figure out what kind of motor to put on it. And this front is pretty weird. The front of this needs some serious work. Because the turning radius on this, it looks like they cut it, but that's the turning radius. Let me show you. It like hits the, that's it. So something's got to be done there. Unless we're going to turn it into a drag strip do doodle bug or whatever it is. So, that's a future project. Still working on this one. I'm going to clean this up. So it's ready for paint in the morning. The sun went down, so... Enough of that for today. I got the uh, go-kart I just got to bring back inside. And... Um, that'll be that. So, we'll carry on tomorrow morning. Slow it down. What is that? Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. She bring gifts. I'm, I gotta get back oh, to work. Oh, shit. Alright, now that my niece is gone, um, I'm gonna assemble this. I made a bracket to hold down the back of the tank. Um. On, on this bolt hole here, it's going to be a bracket onto the tank, and I got a new feed, new gas line with a new clamp, and uh, I'm going to get to putting this together. It's all painted up, so uh, we're going to put it together. I've, I've mistakenly uh, forgot the video record what I was doing down here today. I apologize, apologize, but I used some engine degreaser, a, um, a 3M scrubby pad, and uh, window cleaner. And and Ron watched while I did it. And I uh, watched really hard. And uh, I cleaned up that sprocket. I don't know. First of all, if you look at the lineup of that, that is pretty pretty mint and um, look at the size of that sprocket to the tire talk about a fucking saw blade oh beg my English but talk about a saw blade on there huh look at that if, if he takes any off of that tire that thing is gonna be rubbing on the ground yeah buddy I mean he's got he's got a, about a finger and a half not even but if he puts his finger in there, he'll have a finger in half. Yeah, so that's what that looks like. Oh, and I didn't even show you that rack I put on there. Well, oh, yeah, buddy. So, I got a few more adjustments to make today. Now that the sprocket's on there. Oh, let me take that off so I can show you. So that's what she came out to look like. Look at you, Dizzy. Clean that thing up so badass. It's like nothing ever happened to it. It's got new bolts on it with lock washes. And look at the size of that compared to the tire. Can can everybody say OMG? Oh my God. No, it's oh my goodness. Oh, it's oh my God. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodnessness. Oh my generals. So what has to be done here is... Uh, this tank, you see that? It's got to move over that much because the holes just ain't lining up again. So I'm going to take these two holes that I drilled and I'm going to drill two more over and slide this over. Then cut this even again and repaint it and uh, run like that. I dropped the washer. So that's what I got to do. You know, that's what we mean by custom work. It's totally, totally custom. Oh, man, you dizzy has been busy. And I'll tell you, fabrication, there's not one bit of it that's easy. But I, for some reason, make it look so easy. <laughs> Suave. So I got this thing lined up. I, I'm going to turn the light on so you can see. I got it all bolted in 
lined up with plenty of room for adjustment back and forth with the tank look with plenty of room on the side um, I did leave that hanging over the bottom one only because it didn't stick out over the tire so and it looks it looks cool I mean look at that that just looks cool and the clutch look at that tell me you, that ain't lined up <laughs> that clutch is, is lined up meant there's plenty of room Beautiful sprocket. Everything looks mint. I'm uh, I'm kind of proud of this this build. But uh, you better invest in a bunch of bunch of tires. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. At least one. <laughs> yeah, at least one dozen because this thing is mint. Oh shit! Oh, try these lights. What? Oh shit! Look at that. Oh shit! What? What? Oh shit! We're having fun in the U Dizzy shop today. I got a, I got them sticking the wires in the the battery to my cordless drill. Those are bright. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They, I mean, they're all right for a fucking for a go kart. Nice, nice. Yeah, man. Loving that. Another video by you, Dizzy, with the the cool ass super you, Dizzy cart. Well, here's a walk around of the go kart, um, with everything together. The uh, brake levers work. Um, the the gas works. The all the front end works. I hooked up the uh, kill switch right there. That's wired down in here, along the frame underneath. The throttle's hooked up like that. Zip tied back. That's the custom gas tank shelf. Custom chain guard. The chain's on there. 40, 41 chain with the 41 sprocket. Um pretty big almost the size of the tire uh, and um, it's all wired up I wired it up so the headlights will work so the kill switch will work and uh, it's got the you dizzy signature right on it so that's it and that's it she's said and done <laughs> <laughs>